So I'm doing a tutorial of the app Sketches School, and what I like about it the most is that it is very kid-friendly. I can see that it does not have too many tools and too many bells and whistles that would get too confusing for younger students. You can uh, divide your sections into different folders uh, that you can customize by tables or by classes. What I also like about this app is that it get, has built-in tutorials that are easy for students to understand. So if I click on uh, Sketches Tools, it's going to bring up these cute little pictures that will show the students what all the different tools are available and what they can do. And I think when you open each one, then um, for the first time it kind of gives you uh, a tutorial for it. I also like how you can import photos so you can do layers. Um, I think with the free app you can just do one layer, but if you get Sketches Pro, there's a lot more tools that are available, more color options, a lot more options if you want to pay for um, the upgraded version. So go into experimenting, um, you can change the titles, you can work around, it stores your work in there. If you open up a new document, then it brings up all the tools over on um, the left-hand side, and your colors are over on the right-hand side, so you can change your colors. You can also hold down the color tool, and it will pop up where you can change your values, and you can switch colors all throughout depending on what you're looking for. Then over also on the right hand side you can change your width of your stroke depending on the tools that you're using. Change your colors pretty easily. You have the fill in tool that has uh, different values that you can choose from. So if you want to fill in your entire background It'll do that. You can also draw with this tool. If you create a, a line, it will fill in that color automatically for you. The smudge tool is really nice. And if you use it just like a pencil, you can get your uh, blending strokes in there as well. And it just really moves the color around. The cutting tool and the ruler tool are really nice. What I like about the ruler tool is that it does give you the, uh, the angles. So if you are trying to go for a particular straight line and you need for it to be parallel, when you draw in that straight line you can just move your ruler up and you can change the angle or you can put it right back to that same angle that you had before at a number 20 so that you can create those parallel lines. Um, if you hold down your eraser tool or you double tap your eraser tool, it will erase your entire um, document so that you can start over again if you wanted to. Um, another really nice tool, you have the symmetry tool so that you can create symmetrical images and the undo tool and also you can download different photos. You can download pictures from your camera or your photo and create a bottom layer that will allow students to use, for example, your um, facial guidelines and large to be able to draw on top of your image and then up in the uh, upper right hand corner there's a little eye symbol right there so that if you have uh, drawn on here, you've zoomed in and you started to draw the face and then you want to check and see what it looks like, you can take this away by pressing that eye tool and then it removes the guidelines from the background. So you're left with your actual artwork without the guidelines in there. So there's lots of different uh, techniques and options in here are good for students, the folders, the apps, it's very kid friendly. And that in a nutshell is Sketches School.